Hello, Atlanta Falcon fans. Hello on this Monday. Breaking freaking news. Not just breaking news, but breaking freaking news. Terry Fontenot continues to make moves. He, he, he's made a lot of good moves this offseason. You know, some could make immediate impacts. Also, obviously, he's getting some depth for this team. And obviously, he's plucking guys from the New Orleans Saints to Pudats. No, it's not Cam Jordan, although I would love to have Cam Jordan. You never know. That could happen. But Today, the Atlanta Falcons, breaking news from Atlanta Falcons on Instagram, their official website, NBC Sports, Yahoo, and Falcoholic, that today the Atlanta Falcons signed uh, offensive lineman, what's his name, Ethan Greenidge from the Pudats. Uh, the, the deal is not, uh, is not known yet. I would guess it's probably a one-year deal, minimal money. He hasn't played in the last two years. Uh, he's a big guy, though. You know That's what we need. Uh, he's from uh, Villanova. Obviously, you like big names, but on every team, you have to have big names, but also the guys that come in sparingly can be big names. Just got to give them playing time. It's kind of hard for players to, uh, to make name for themselves and make plays and become well-known and produce if they don't play much. You know, so you need to have depth. So I, I don't really know what this is going to be, but I do like the fact that Terry Fontenot is stretching out as much money as he can to improve this football team, which he clearly has done on paper and everything. So if you're not excited about being a Falcons fan, definitely this year, I don't know what. But, uh, yeah, it's a great sign. And also they, they signed earlier Josh Mills from the Cardinals. I'm guessing he's on offense as well because he was listed under, you know, Jermaine Orfetti and, you know, when we re-signed Caleb McGarry and, and Lindstrom and all this stuff. So, uh, not only beefing up the defense, pass rush finally, but also the um, O-line, which is great. And it was pretty good last year. You know, I mean, we had a top five running game last year, and the sacks were down as far as being allowed. You know, slow progress. But uh, Falcons make another signing, take away the poot ads. People on Instagram, most of them are supportive. But some are like, well, why stop? Why keep signing Saints players? Because it's fun. It's always fun when we can pluck something from them. Instead of the big easy, call them the big losers. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel, guys, if you want real Atlanta sports content. No clickbait, no nonsense, no false rumors, and giving you the straight facts. Slip of Sports Live in the ATL. Click that uh, subscribe button. Share it. And I'll see you in the next one.